Good afternoon, South Florida. I'm Christy Krueger. Here's a look at some of the stories making news today. We're now seeing dash cam video after a police chase ended in a rollover crash on the Julia Tuttle Causeway. Police say that Salvis Cigar attacked a woman, carjacking her with a hammer, and the suspect then led police on big chase. It happened Sunday along Alton Road. You can see how that suspect is stopped before the car flips over. Troopers get that suspect quickly into custody. It is a big day for students in the state's largest school district. First day of school in Miami-Dade County. 34,000 district employees are back along with more than 337,000 students at more than 520 different schools. Sky 10 over the action as students arrived this morning. Many of them were met by bands and cheerleaders, athletic teams to help welcome them back. All Broward and Monroe County schools have already opened earlier this week. A Lauder Hill police officer is facing video voyeurism charges. He is 42 year old Johnny Mateo. He was arrested last night at his home in Sunrise on digital visit video voyeurism charges on a person 19 years of age or older. The exact circumstances surrounding his arrest are still unclear. Mateo is now on administrative leave. As breaking news happens, we have you covered both on air and online. You can head to local10.com for more local news coverage and updates all day long. Have a good day.